Hello and welcome back to the DVD Silver Silvertale. I did exactly what I said I did. Stopped the video right there because it was running too long. And now we pick up exactly where I left off. Uh, yeah. Morale up. What a shame. I'm not doing that this time. You heard, you heard that I did morale? Well, not anymore. Uh, attacks regenerate hero's life by 50% of damage dealt. That's going to be a pain in the rear. So, I want you somewhere. Area, area, area. Wow. So I want you, who cares? It actually doesn't matter, because they're all being hit by the same stuff. Fire, nature, and more nature. I just want people with fire resistance and nature resistance. Which is you. And is not you. And is not you. And is not you. Um, I guess I'll go for you, because you've got a pretty fast speed, and you'll probably get at least one attack. Is my reasoning. Uh, why don't you avoid traps, right? Oh no, you just take less damage from traps. Well, that's another matter entirely. Um, what do we think? Top up the bleed? Yeah, just top up the bleed generally, I think. I do need to try and find an opportunity to improve my traps. Now, I hate to say it, but I'm desperately hoping that you all die. So that I finally get a chance to use the cool Hydra. It looks so cool. And then me. Yeah, you know. I see promise in that intern. One day, they'll be even better than me. Yep, who cares? <laughs> Move around all you like. All your attacks are area, so it means nothing. I wonder if I can get a monster one day that can do that same thing and move the hero's alignment around. Probably just for the one turn, because why wouldn't they just rearrange themselves? Um, why wouldn't they just re rearrange themselves? Because they've got all the time in the world. Maybe. Unless, well, I mean, they don't stop and, you know, patch up their wounds or anything. Uh, well, there, there's a bit of burn, but that's not what we're going to Or is it? <laughs> we're increasing... Oh, that actually increased the demoralized, because... Because that just so happened to be the thing that was highest. That's unusual for this run. Well, it's kind of a shame that didn't trigger, like... That one died first, technically. Okay. Well, they're not as hurt as I'd like. Uh, applies Frostbite. Tempting. Easy target. Well... Oh wait, easy target. Damage from traps increased 100%. Hmm. They are just about to be hit by a trap. Although it's more about doing bleed damage than just damage. But we'll, we'll give that a shot. And then the trap comes along. Best trap. That actually worked out pretty well, I think. Okay, what's my options? Set him on fire? Sure. Why wouldn't I set him on fire? Oh dear. All those lovely stacks of bleed gone. Yep, hope you're nice and moralized. You're too injured for that to matter. Oh, they're not going to get a chance to see the Hydra. But I want them to see the Hydra. Huh? Did he really have zero stacks of... No. Oh, no, no, they must have both had three and then... Yeah, he applied three and passed them back. That would make sense. Um... Hmm, honestly, at this point, I think I'm going to do this. Yeah. What's interesting is if he does that to something with armor, if the next doesn't have armor... No. Turns out that's not very effective, and then... Oh well. Kill one outright? Yeah, why not? Hi! <laughs> But I wanted to use the Hydra! Why? Why do you deny me my Hydra usage? Hydra, no! One day. One day. One day I'll get to use the Hydra! I haven't got to use it since I got it. It's not fair. <laughs> it's not fair. Why are my monsters so good at their jobs? Okay, what do you do? 
You do do a lot of bleeding damage right at the front, though. Um, honestly, since I'm trying to apply bleed to everyone ev evenly, it doesn't behoove me to shoot at all the front. Oh, finally. Therapist. Do I need therapy? Maybe a little bit. Okay. Um, extend the therapy session. And that means all my people are, f well, almost fine. Almost entirely fine. Okay, you're a little tanky, so we'll put you here. We've got a whole lineup. That's fun. Um, I can totally take on a champion with this sort of lineup. Huh, Bone Dog. Um, sure. I can always do something with it. Okay. Once more unto the breach, as it were. Oh, it's you. Move three stacks from each penalty applied to her at the start of each turn. Damage dealt reduced by 20%. Oh, you're damage dealt to her or for her? Uh, I wanted to say that she used to do a lot of damage. No? Okay. I mean, well, a fair bit of nature everywhere. Okay, I mean, that's one shot. Yeah, okay, so her damage is actually pretty high. And hits everyone, but it goes down if she's penaltied. But she removes them, removes the penalties too. So, nature everywhere is going to be a pain. A real pain. Fire at the back, ice at the front. Um, I guess I'll put you here. And I guess I'll put you, geez, uh, here? No, I can't do that. I'll put you in the middle. No way, I can't do that. I have to, though. I wanted to use this guy, but I just can't see a good place for him. But he's got ice resistance, actually. He might he might be okay-ish. Maybe. Um, right, then we start getting in the traps. Hit them. You dodge the first trap, so we'll put in the little trap first. Then the big trap. Yeah. I'm smarting you. And then... Let me see. Ice at the front. That's a pain. You resist ice a little. So we'll put you at the front. Uh, fire at the back. You don't resist fire, but you do. And then you can sit nice and snug in the middle. And then the Hydra. We might actually get to use it this time. Wait. What was that ability on him? Did I not pay attention? Can't be affected by poison. I should have read that a bit more thoroughly. Oh well. I apply poison to everyone else. I think in some ways I'm rushing because now that I'm actually keeping a slightly better, um, a slightly better track of my episode times, or I'm trying to anyway, it does mean that these episodes are actually quite short. Oh darn. Well, at least he used up that skill now. Like, before it was that important. Okay, take him out. We get a skeleton over here. More bleed. I guess. Jeez, I mean, she really loses penalties fast. Hey, wait! Oh, it was that one that triggered. No one was wondering, but he's dead! It's like, oh no, we've actually got another method of doing that. The traditional method. Six bleed. That's lovely. That should stick around for a while. And then be passed straight back to her. That vampire's gonna have an interesting time keeping bleed on her. Oh, it's the weak trap for us. But... He may dodge that one, but he won't dodge the next one. I guess I might as well apply... Oh, wait, no. Not Frostbite time yet. But I'll probably be applying Frostbite. Or will I apply slow? Because I wouldn't mind my my critters all getting to attack first. Um, Easy target. No, no point. Slowed is interesting. Frostbite is good, though. 
more damage over time. You know, it's surprising they could sit around the fire and have their morale built up while one of their people just died of frostbite right next to them. You'd think it would ruin it for them. You would do a lot of damage to her. But I don't think so. Not yet, anyway. What's also kind of nice if you have a tank like this, or like just someone with so much health that they effectively tank, that they can just keep passing bleed back. Oh, wait, she's not good against fire, right? Oh, yes. Burn, baby, burn. Um. Sure. Let's see if we can get her out. She's dangerous. I kind of thought he might actually not last. There he is. Oh, she got rid of the debuffs before. That's not fair. That's not fair at all. I'm going to use this move just because it's faster. The other move takes so long to to rank itself, um, ramp itself up. Uh, Multi-action to the next trap. Now that's tempting. It hits their morale a bit, but it makes the next trap really good. And he doesn't exactly do much good for me. Okay, I'll take you, because I think I can make you work for me. Multi-action to a single trap. Tempting. Okay, what are you offering me? Nothing I really want. I could renew it, but I don't care that much. Ooh, interview. Look in on your intern and tech check up on their progress. Well, so far, they've gotten to do diddly. <laughs> Is this like an upgrade for the intern, though? Interview my intern? <laughs> oh, this is fun. <laughs> Let her have her fun. I love this. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. It seems that the Hydra has caught a passing employee and is now toying with them. Rescue the employee. They're enraged. Play for a bit, but we need to rescue them. Or let her have her fun. The Hydra eats our employee. Okay, well that's actually the only option I seem to have right now. Oh wait, no, I could choose different options. Nah, I'm not taking uh, the Hydra's toy away from her. <laughs> oh, jeez. That's plus 40 to resistances. That, that the Hydra is going to get really powerful really fast. We are down an employee now, though, for some reason. I can't imagine why. I'm sorry that I get so giggly playing this game, but it's just so funny. They've done so well with their with their humor, I feel anyway. Oh, hello. Uh, replaces penalties with bonus. I hate that one. Mm-hmm. Removes the penalties. Okay. Uh, the skill also removes all penalties. Okay, seems like it's catching on to my penalty strategy. Here's a question. Does it catch on to your strategies? Is it capable of that? Okay, so we've got ice and air at the front. That's going to sting. Um, this is probably a bit more about just keeping them away from us. I wouldn't mind having him at the back. Um, he should do okay at the back. It should also allow us to apply more everything. Hmm... I think we're going to try and stick with a bleed, I guess. I don't know. We'll just see how this works. So. Uh, oh, I didn't put that trap in. Oh, well, the next trap's after us anyway, so who cares? Um, That's strange. This one's always been right up against us. I wonder if eventually the Colossal Hydra will be the first thing they fight. That'd be interesting. I wonder what happens if it dies. I mean, I assume you just bring it back and it's not like us. Look at the resistances on that Hydra. Just look at them. It has no weaknesses. That thing is probably more powerful than I am. Um, see, it's almost, yeah, very powerful. Uh, right, so. I thought at some point, didn't we get a third monster room? Is that not a thing anymore? Is it like we get the mini boss instead? That'd be interesting, but it would also throw me off a little, actually. 
Uh, unless that's something that's coming later. I don't know. Anyway, uh, air and ice at the front. You kind of resist that, but I also want you to not die. Um, so I'm probably going to put you at the back anyway. You don't resist that very well. You don't resist that much of anything very well. Um, this is just kind of a stay away from my vampire kind of play. Hydra! Rawr! And assuming they survive all of that, we'll just uh, put the rest through a mincer and see how that works for us. Right, so we demoralize them, so wherever good that's, that is. Apply bleed. Oh, maybe if we're lucky, she'll get rid of that. One of her penalties, so it could be any of them. Oh, it's nice to see he also applies burn. Boom. Which will actually help with this guy, although that one's so demoralized, he's just going to end up duplicating the demoralizing. Which is a bit demoralizing. Oomph. Aww. Mean. At least he's used up that skill now, so he can't do it anymore. That's one strength of just hitting him with the same strategy over and over again. Any skill that doesn't suit you very well won't get that many attempts. Well, bleed is out the window, but at least we can probably burn. Assuming he gets a turn, which he will. He might not get another turn after that, but he will get this one. And they're not getting rid of that very fast. Well, she will if she gets a turn. Uh, she'll turn into a positive, which is going to be very annoying. Or... Ah, she can only do it once, so she can never do it again. That's handy. That's very handy. He's managed to live a fair few turns. Unfortunately, those delaying tactics don't work very well if my penalties get taken off them very fast. Ouch. Hmm. Well, at least that still works. What's this button do? Burn. Okay, we've got some nice debuffs on them. She's got to be heavily armored, so his uh, passing on ability. She's just so... 90 air resistance. Yikes. His, like, kill move wouldn't do a thing to her. Come oh, on, I want to use my Hydra. I can't believe I'm cheering on the heroes, but I want to use my blinking Hydra. I suspect we might... Well... Am I going to get a chance to pass all that bleed down the chain? Maybe. Ow. She's got enough resistance that, yep, he's not going to do, he's not going to manage to kill her. Which means we might get, what is it, 26? 26 bleed on that guy. That's going to hurt. I love things that stack and multiply in games like this, because it's just so much fun. 130 damage just from bleed. Oh, that's nice. That's very handy. How much bleed can we get on the one behind him? <laughs> I'm surprised it doesn't do more, because air resistance... It's like, damage down increased by 10% per stack. Because that doesn't stack. It does so little damage, really. When you consider he has 28 stacks on him. Okay, now we got 31 and 30. I mean, they're not surviving that much bleed. I'm su surprised they're surviving this well. How much health did they have in the first place? Ouch! Oh look! We get to see the Hydra at long last! Oh wait. Oh yeah, okay, we do, we do. <laughs> she survived with the skin of her teeth to get to the Hydra. Go in turn, go! Oh, wait. She got to see the Hydra, but she didn't get to do anything. Come on, man. Uh, that's... Tempting, but we'll go for this one just because it's an upgrade of what we already have. <sighs> Why will wh when will the Hydra get a chance to shine? Oh when, oh when, oh whatever. Anyway, 
Um, I think we can keep this line up the way it is. We'll put you in though. Uh, engineer or trainer? Hmm, tempted by engineer actually. Yeah, let's go for engineer. Because uh, I want to upgrade. I want you to go away and never come back. Can't do it, can I? Not while this is up. Which means that it's a complete waste of time? Yep. Oh, forget it. No, let's upgrade this one too, so it gets three bleeding damage. Okay, I want my blinking traps fixed out. In. Thank you. Jeez. At least we get another chance. Icarus. A wizard with a strange hat has fallen from the sky and landed in the entrance hall. He was carrying a magical artifact. Merchant price reduce. Oh, cool. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Multi-action one. Multi-action two. That's what we're aiming for. Um, although, yeah, at this point... At this point, no. I'll, I want to get this one up, because if that can feed into this, then we can get that level of trap times three. Uh, I think this is definitely the right call. Um, hmm. Well, I want you upgraded first. So we will set rent out those ones, just for the sheer cash. And then we'll go in here. Bring it. Bring it, you, you heroes. So-called heroes. Oh, it's you again. Uh, damage dealt to monsters affected by enraged increased. Heals and removes penalties. Applies broken armor and dodges my first trap. Uh, heals their maximum life. Alright, well, that's not too bad. Air at the front, fire everywhere, ice at the back. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll put you at the back then, just because you resist ice. Mm, she kind of does too. But, um, air at the front. You resist air a bit. I'm actually surprised how much I'm using poison on these guys, but he's at, he can apply a lot of poison in a short period of time. Okay, so they dodge the f he dodges the first trap, so we'll make it the blade trap. And then we'll make it the better blade trap. And then, when all that is done... Poor Hydra, you're not going to get to see the light of day again, are you? Isn't that me being cocky? Uh, right. Ice at the back. Not you, then. I wish we could use you more, but... Haha, <laughs> with a fire resistance of 70, I don't think we should be putting you in. Um, yeah, you're fairly tanky. I used to upgrade you a lot more. If I remember, you actually get pretty good. Rawr. Come on, heroes. You're going to need to do better than that. I'm training an intern here. At the moment, all this blinking Hydra is doing is fetching me coffee, which admittedly they are very good at, with three mouths to carry trays. They can fetch a lot of coffee in a short period of time, but that's not what they're here for. I really love the debuffs. Yeah. Should play Monster Sanctuary for y'all. See my uh <laughs> my debuff deck. Well, debuff strategy. You know, debuffs. And more debuffs, and even more debuffs, because I love debuffs. No bones about it, this team's doing well. But um <laughs> it's funny to have a skeleton reanimated as, as a skeleton. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> That's a nice amount of bleeding her, though. She's already used her skill, if memory serves. She can heal some life, and she probably will. Um, which won't be too much of a problem, because we still got the... Oh, she didn't do it. She's saving that one. That's a bit annoying, actually. Razor blades. I wonder just how much bleed we can stack on this one at the front and then pass back. That's what I like about the bleed, though. It just, um... 
it uh, gets past all resistances. I'm sure someone who is really good at this could set up a team of critters with very powerful attacks of single elements and set them up such that they could actually exploit these resistances beautifully. I am not that person. I am not that skilled, and I doubt I ever shall be. That hurts, sir. Has he got both armor break and elemental resistance? Yikes, that guy just takes... Sorry, girl, Jane, takes them apart. Hellbringer. That's, uh, that's appropriate. Oh, aw, we don't get a chance to pass on the bleed again? That's a shame. Maybe my Hydra will see the light of day if we can't ridiculously stack the bleed. Look at that beautiful hit. But now they both have 20 bleed. And in theory, I could make that, what was it, uh, two 19s, potentially? More, actually. Well, how's your armor? Bad. Oh, that's fun. I guess that means impalement might be worth it. I know, I'm not stacking bleed. What am I doing? Don't you fret, I'll be getting to the bleed stacking in just a moment. Oh, this is going to be fun. 41 bleed. Is there an achievement for getting even more? 205 damage just from bleeding. We're getting close to, like, the, the amount of damage that he did with his powered attack just from uh, damage over time, which is absolutely my jam. Hmm. I feel like there's less things that resist bleeding than resist demoralize. Ooh, tempting. I could go there and get a bunch of money from the health that I'm not losing. Come on, I know you want to keep fighting, but... Uh, it's just not your time. Yeah, I guess we'll set this up this way instead. Yeah, a couple of my monsters are getting a little bit sad. Um, yeah, you just, um... Yeah, I regenerate life. And I've got a bit of time. Who's going on a business trip? You, maybe? T to improve our demoralization thing? What's the point? Yeah, we'll send you. You get a bit of morale back, and we get some money. I don't think I've ever had this much money just sitting around. Bloodthirsty coach. Improve these guys. Sure. I'll take that. Engineer. Ooh, tempting, tempting. Are my traps currently in play? Because I know I sent that one away. I sent it away, so I couldn't upgrade it even if I wanted to. Which means there's no traps I want to upgrade right now. Which means that would have been a waste of my time. Which means we're doing yoga instead. <laughs> it's just, I'm trying to imagine the centaur doing yoga. What is a centaur yoga position? Okay, can anyone tell me that? I guess I'm going for the champion, actually. I feel confident enough. And my hydra might finally see some action! I want to see my hydra in action. Go in turn. Go in turn, go. Okay, what do we have here? Um, oh, it's you again. You're a little annoying, but not too bad. So you make them weak, you hit ice at the front. Frostbite. Oh! Frostbite is 5% of their maximum life as ice damage a turn? I thought it was just 5 damage a turn, like every other debuff. If that's the case, Frostbite is very powerful. I should be looking into that more. Oh, and Burn is the same too? Bleed isn't like that, is it? Yeah, yeah, bleed is just five per turn. I guess... Bleed is too easy to apply? Okay, none of you dodge traps, so I might as well just hit you with full up with a circular saw. That's interesting. Does poison work like bleed, or does it work like these? I need to look into those more, apparently. If burn does that much damage, then... Jeez, I should be just setting them on fire. Right, ice to the front. You resist ice, you don't. You do nature everywhere, which is going to rip these two apart in a single stroke. So there's no point putting them in at all. They won't last five minutes. Uh, fire everywhere. Let me see. I guess I'll put you at the back. 
because you might survive a few moments. This is not an ideal team for my normal strategy, but hey, they can do some damage. That's the nice thing about the damage strategy as opposed to demoralize, I suppose. Any monster can do it to some degree. And more or less, depending on how you use them. But none of them are inept at it. Uh, let me see, I'll put you at the front just because I honestly think you'll survive a bit better. And you consider the back. You don't have the best resistances, but I think you'll last. And then the Hydra! We might actually get to use you, Hydra! That'd be fun, wouldn't it? You haven't got to do anything. You saw a hero once, but then they just fell dead in front of you. Dragged themselves into your room. Your office, as it were. <laughs> Who am I kidding? You don't get an office. Her ability is nasty. Um, right, I'm getting the feeling that we're not doing that well. Boom. Ouch. I mean, at least the trap applied some bleeding before they got here. At least we managed to lure her into using her healing skill. So that's not going to come around to bite us in the backside. You know what? Ah, oh, I love the morale strategy. I love it so much. I use nothing but it till this run. But honestly, being able to ignore all of the things they put in to hit morale damage completely. Because morale, as I said, is all or nothing. You either go for it full bore or you don't bother at all. Being able to ignore all of that, because there's so much against morale now. Um, that's not actually that much more damage. Whereas we can just keep passing the blood back. Yeah, 5% of, of life is fire damage. It only ever does 5%, so I guess in that way it's capped at 5%? No matter how much you stack it, I guess in that way, it's maybe almost worse. Because you can't make it crazy. Oh darn, you still have that ability? Dude, they're definitely getting to the Hydra. Oh darn. Um, I didn't realize you still had that ability. I guess I didn't think about it. Okay. Okay, they've made it to the Hydra. All of them have made it to the Hydra. <laughs> Do you want to try that again? <laughs> I think that tickled that my Hydra. Okay, that hurt a little. Uh, okay, what options do we have? Um, set everyone on fire is tempting. We could possibly just kill him outright. Well, not quite outright, but the bleeding would do it. I feel like I want to set them all on fire. How are you not dead, sir? His attack is the one that worries me the most. What's her nature resistance like? Come on, Hydra. You can do better than this. It's just a shame we've got Miss Anti Penalty right there. Okay, now that he's down, the Hydra is taking so much less damage from everything. I feel like I don't want to apply more of that, because it just feels... I feel like what I really want to do is just hit her at the front as hard as I can. She's the problem. One of the back isn't that much of a problem. She doesn't do that much damage, all in all. I mean, I could apply poison to her just for the sake of it. But... Since I can't really bleed the one at the front, I feel like what I really do need to do is hit them hard. No, in turn. Oh, I believe in you. I know it didn't go so well, but... You can do it. 
Okay, she won't get rid of all of that bleed. And I could just keep hitting them, but I think I can see if I can get rid of her completely. I think the bolt. I'm gonna keep whipping them until Whiplash can take care of her completely. Should be this turn, I think. Here I am, still hurt from the vampires. I didn't think they'd get past the Hydra, honestly. That Hydra's got a lot of lovely debuff potentials. Bye bye. I so wish this did more for even more bleeding. Well, it doesn't. Aha. Another one of him, or even more chance. I think I'll take the even more chance, thanks. Hmm. A lot of my monsters aren't very happy right now. That's a shame. Uh, you can still take a little more, but I don't really want you to have to take a little more. I guess we'll put you back in, and you back in. Uh, where's our... Hmm. Oh, right, he's off. He wasn't the one who got eaten by the Hydra. That's just it, Hydra. I, I let you eat a goblin. I let you eat that goblin completely. You should, uh... You should be putting in a bit more effort. Mm-hmm. What is the event? Understaffing. He's a guinea pig. Mm, I think I've got the gold right now. I don't need to sacrifice them. A seminar. That's really the only one we can afford? That would be so good. And then these tears, so we're never going to get that. Well, I guess I can sacrifice some blood for that. Ooh, an interview. Hi. Oh, Lord. Um, I haven't used you for a while, you know. I guess I'll let the Hydra have her fun. She just ate another one. I need more monsters. I need to hire more monsters to replace the ones she keeps eating. Ooh, another one of these could be really fun, actually. There you go. Some disposable monsters for her to eat. <laughs> I feel bad about it. Okay, I really want to train up these guys. I feel like I need to. Um, right. There's some people I won't let her eat, but... I just don't like that, you know, it just hurts their morale because the massive Hydra is batting them around like a plaything. Damage dealt uh, is increased if they do if they're burned, but you don't apply burn. Um, yeah, okay. Let's make you better because I really kind of like you. I mean, I got another one of you for a reason, you know. I can drain almost all my critters with the sheer amount of everything I have. Uh, is that applying more bleeding or just more damage? Oh, more bleeding. That's good, actually. Well, now that I've used up all my money. <laughs> Broken trap. Oh, who cares? Um, can we send that trap away? I know it's a bit faulty right now, but... Mm. Mm, that's tempting, actually. Yeah, let's send one of these ones. Because I should have the other trap back now, shouldn't I? Shouldn't I? Uh, yes, I do. Great, these two traps will work well together, I think. Uh, let's have some vets. Oh, I should have ended this episode. I don't want to! <laughs> one more fight, one more fight. I think. I could just do what I did last time and end it partway through, but... Oh, hello. You look a bit tough. Arthur. You seem like a champion. But I didn't choose champion, I chose veteran. But you seem pretty powerful. Gets enraged when another hero is defeated. Applies enraged to everyone. You do a lot of damage. I'm pretty sure that guy's a champion, isn't he? Immune to my spells. Applies poison. Hits nature in the front. That's annoying. Um, this does do multi-trip. Oh, it only does multi-action one, doesn't it? Well, we're using that one anyway. Um, right. Fire at the front. Deals ice damage to everyone. Ricochets. This guy is going to be increasing their damage like crazy. That's not fun. That's really not fun, Maths. 
Okay, physical at the front, nature of the front, fire at the front. So, hmm. I feel like I want to put my best dog at the front, just... Yeah, I think I need to do something like this. It's not perfect, but it might do okay. So this one should be multi-actioned, at least. So it should hit them twice. And then they come around here to the vampire. Uh, I guess you've really got to be at the front, don't you? Put you there and you at the back to try and protect you. I suppose I could have put him in. Tempting? But no, we want to we want to maximize bleed here before they get to the Hydra. Come on in turn. You can do it. Your resistances have all been increased by 80. Just need to improve their armor, I assume. But you should be able to resist almost anything that isn't physical at this point. Size is just Arthur. It's not Odysseus. Uh, right. Admittedly, he might go well with that guy if he does more damage to the burnt, because he burns them. Yeah, he does more damage to people with burnt. Boom. Not bad, actually. Those two work well together. I mean, not that well, but well enough. And this burn is apparently pretty useful. It takes out 5%, but that's then presumably reduced by their fire resistance. Because... He doesn't seem to be doing 5% of his health. Certainly not. Yeah. 24, because... 5% uh, of his health would be... Well, let's see, 10% of his health would be almost 100. Almost. So 5% would be almost 50, so definitely not. Just bleed them dry. And then bleed them even drier. Took one right out. That's good. Okay. We're doing alright. Now set them on fire even more. I should possibly have enraged them, but that one gets more powerful when they're enraged. Sure, heal your morale all you like. Be good and moralized for what's to come. Holy Face your death bravely. Yes, yes. You can, uh, you can do that all you like, but uh, I may actually start needing to use the other ability, just because this guy's got a lot of resistance to being killed. I mean, these guys can help improve the bleed, but I think one of the back is hurt enough. You just need to hit this guy hard. Fortunately, this guy is pretty resistant to everything. Good Arthur! Maybe they won't reach the Hydra again. That Hydra needs a chance to redeem themselves. It's good for their morale. Just keep eating people. I mean, it's, it's clear they've got a stress problem, an eating disorder. They need a boost to confidence. And they're not going to get that if they don't get a chance to fight. Okay, my stuff is... Um, I feel like I should have more armor if my intern has lots of resistance. Because if they get through my intern easily, then they must not be hitting in the resistances very much. I'm theorizing. Oh, anyway, I may sadly have to stop here. I don't want to... I may end up recording the next episode next, because that should be the last one of this particular run, anyway, whether I win or lose. Maybe this is the one where I win! Yay! So by the time I post this, they'll probably have another update out. Boo! Because then, oh, then my video will be out of date. Extra boo. Anyway, this was Silvertail. Be sure to come back if you like what you see. Remember to always pick a plan D. Because here, there'll be dragons. Or a hydra, anyway.